Hollow Town today find themselves with a chance to extend their lead at the top of the Thurlow Nun Division 1 South and they face Mayhem Baker who they haven't faced since 2023 when they scored a last minute winner due to an Alex Luque goal at Averley. Mayhem Baker's corner. Lamina with a header and that one not going to cause James Pellin any problems. Jason Pauline lining one up. James Pelling can collect. Denzeleffa cuts outside down the left hand side into the box. Spilt by Keeble. On the follow up was Karadi de Silva. But Keeble recovered well. Denzeleffa looks for the cross. Jack Haley running in and into the side netting this time. Here's Jesse Anson. Hits the ball forward. All the way forward. And running is Fred Agyeman. Keeble's taken out his own player and he couldn't miss. Hollow Town take the lead and it's that man once again, his 11th goal of the season. Fred Aguimang scores for Hollow Town and that might just be the easiest goal he'll ever score in his career. Denzeleffa stands over the corner for Harlow Town, whipped into the box. Fabian Sims' is header and the lead is doubled. Fabian Sims with the goal. Hollow Town will have no complaints at this stage of the first half. Jesse Anson running onto this, but he's been robbed of it by Anthony Cook. Plays that ball forward. Here's Jack Ferris for May and Baker. And it didn't take them long. They've got a goal back. A good finish from Jack Ferris. But Hollow Town will ask questions of their defensive play there. Jack Haley. Lovely footwork to get around the Mayan Baker player. Into Karadi De Silva. Back to Jack Haley. Refuses the shot on his left. Takes it on on his right. And a good save in the end by Liam Keeble. Denzel Effa's corner. Towards that back post. Headed by James Folks. Good save by Keeble. Karadi De Silva very quick to anticipate that one. And now look at the space. Plays it square. Jack Haley first time. And he knows he should have gone for a corner there. Keeble easily taking that out to Jack Haley. First time crossing to the box. Flicked on. Here's Fred Aguimang on his left. And no real menace behind that one. Into James Folks. Whips it straight in there. Headed but not fully clear. And Aguimang sends it out of the stadium. Grady De Silva plays it out to Jack Haley in a lot of space. Gets the cross in and a great header that is. Fred Aguimang makes it three. And this might just soon become a cricket score for Harlow Town. They're running away with things here. Looks like it's going to be an in-swinging one from Denzel Effa. Straight in there. James Folks' header and that wasn't a million miles away. Fred Aguimang plays that ball down the right-hand side. A sprinting Arlie Barker gets there. Across goal, here's Gavin Cockman. Oh yes, look at that for a return, Gavin Cockman. It was inevitable. Over a year after hanging up those boots, prematurely due to injury, you just knew that Gavin Cockman would be back on the score sheet. And it was a good finish too. That one was collected by Liam Keeble, who goes for the long throw. Picked up by Denzel Effa. Big mistake, a cross goal and it's five. Jordan Burnett's in on the act now. It goes from bad to worse for Mayan Baker.